Hi everyone, it's Anne once again and today I'm going to talk a little about the biplanes that I've made so far. They are all planes that were used during the Spanish Civil War and they'll be featured on the future uh, documentary about the war that I'm currently working on. So, we have four biplanes here. We have the Fiat CR32, made in Italy. In here we have the Polycarpov I-15, which was made in the Soviet Union. We have the Hawker Fury, made in the United Kingdom. And finally, we have the Einkel HA-51, built in Germany. On the left, we have the planes used by the fascists, or the nationalists, as you want to call them. And on the right side, we have the planes used by the republicans. And we'll see each one in detail in a moment. The first one that I'm going to talk is the Polycarpov I-15. This biplane has a fixed landing gear like the other biplanes that I've featured before. And um, the most interesting thing about this model, it has the this hinge technique over here to give the correct shape for the upper wing. And it's quite strong and sturdy, it doesn't move at all. And it was also the first time that I bought purple bricks to be used here on the the flag from on the rear. The next plane is the Hawker Fury. Only three of these planes were provided by the United Kingdom before the war started. The idea was to start the production in Spain of about 50 examples, but war started and only those three planes were used. The first nationalist plane that I want to show is the Fiat CR32. I'm very happy with the, the camouflage that I used for this uh, example. This one was operating from the Balearis Island. And I used tan and reddish brown and dark green to make the camouflage with light grey on, on the under surfaces. And it's a very neat model. Last but on the list, we have the Einkel HA-51, which was supplied by the Germans uh, to the nationalists at the start of the war. This biplane was used by the Condor Legion. We can see that it, this model features the, the external fuel tank under the fuselage. It has interesting cockards or randles, as you call them, identifying this plane as a nationalist plane. So the nationalists had this black circles on the wings with the St. Andrew cross on the tail, while the Republicans painted their planes with red parts and with the national flag on the tail. And so that's it. I hope you guys like it. Don't forget to visit my Flickr page and subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you, and see you next time.